Let's create a Python interpreter in VS Code that we can use in our project. And before creating a Python interpreter, you must need to have Python already installed in your project. That is not related to Visual Studio Code. That is just a Python interpreter that we just, we just download Python and we just install it. So if you already have Python installed, what you can do for your project is you can use the global Python version or you can create a virtual environment that you can use for this project. Now, the best practice is you create a virtual environment and then you use that virtual interpreter, that, that virtual environment's interpreter as the Python. So how you can do that is, as you can see down here, uh, you'll probably be seeing select an interpreter or this thing here. Now, if you are seeing select an interpreter or this, in any case, you click on that and you will see a list of Python interpreters that are available. And now, if you don't have this available, you need to install Python in Visual Studio Code. So how to do that? Go to extensions or press Control shift x and you will open this extensions now in extensions you need to install python so i already have this installed if you don't what you can do is type python and in the marketplace you will see a lot of these things but you need to install python that is from microsoft itself i already have this installed so this install button is not visible otherwise install buttons like this will be visible you click on that and it will install Python. Now this Python is installed, you can create virtual environments or you can create interpreters, let's say. So to do that, after that is after the Python extension is installed, you press Control and Shift and P. And as you can see, it recently used this already, this Python create environment. You click on this if it is available to you, or you can just type Python create environment. And now this will be available. Click on this and click on create virtual environment in the current workspace using the env now again you will see this and you will see which interpreter to use in this virtual environment now you click on this one that is available i don't have others available you can click on any python if you have multiple available and now i have this requirements.txt that contains the requirements for this project crypto trading bot oh by the way i am creating this project and i will show you how you can create your own trading bot and make a lot of money probably so if you want to learn that, stay tuned, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Okay, and anyway, uh, I can check the requirements.txt and click OK, and it will install all the dependencies in this requirements.txt also. But I don't want that because that will take quite some time. Uh, so I uncheck this and click OK. And now a VENV with a specific interpreter for this project is being created. Once this is being created, we can select this interpreter for this project. So let's wait till this is created and I'll show you how you can do that. Okay, as you can see, we have this message. We have selected the following environment, D Python crypto trading project. Now that means our virtual environment is being created with Python interpreter and we can use that. So now we have two, as you can see earlier, we had one that is the global one that was available to all the projects. And now we have a Python interpreter specific to our project using virtual environment. So I can click on this. And now this is selected. Let's run this and see if it works or not. The shortcut to run is F5. And now as you can see, hello world, we are creating a Python interpreter in VS Code is being printed. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.